Hello there, Diorama Don here once more with another new video. Uh, this is slightly different to uh, the normal type of things that I do. Uh, if you've seen any of my other videos, uh, and if not, why not? <laughs> um, uh, they, they're normally of uh, 135 scale buildings, um, roads, bridges, um, that kind of thing. Uh, you'll, you'll see in, in, in my list of videos what, what I normally do. So this is uh, something that I worked on some time ago that I thought may interest some of you. Um, this is more in keeping with uh, HO or 00 scale uh, train layouts where you have uh, moving cars uh, apart from trains. It just seems a shame that uh, uh, trains go round and round and, and yet you have to stick cars uh, in their stationary position and they don't move. Um, there are a number of systems on the market, all of which are rather expensive, I feel. Uh, so this is just um, an idea that if you're interested, uh, you, you may take uh, a stage further. Uh, so all I'm doing is, is just showing a, you a, a basic idea of what is possible. Uh, but um, you will then have to uh, elaborate. That's the word I'm looking for. So I bought uh, a number of these um, cogs. They're from uh, a bi uh, they're bicycle spares. Uh, they really were just only a matter of pennies to buy. They're just plastic cogs. They're, they're to do with the bicycle gearing. Uh, um, very, very inexpensive. Uh, and one slightly bigger one there. And this is just an ordinary bicycle chain. So uh, again, not, not that expensive. Uh, and screwing the cogs in uh, a, a piece of uh, a chipboard in this case, um, we can we can get that kind of thing going. Uh, and once I'd got that, I thought uh, if we had magnets underneath and on top, that would move vehicles around um, a town or uh, whatever uh, whatever you've got on your, your, your train layout. So I bought these very, very small small magnets, um, five millimeter by two millimeter, very small, but very strong. And they sit very nicely in, uh, in the link of the chain. Okay, so we have a magnet there. And then in these small cars, I just uh, super glued a small piece of uh, cardboard on the bottom with a, another magnet there. So if it was the right, <laughs> right way round, <laughs> two ways and I do the wrong one. But you get the idea. So with a, a piece of card between the magnets, <clears throat> that will take the car around the circuit. Obviously, uh, not like that. But uh, with the card with the card between uh, between the um, magnets, it should uh, should take the the uh, vehicle round. So what I need to do is uh, fill the area uh, between the um, chain to build it up to the to the right height. Uh, with I should do that with the polystyrene, half inch polystyrene. It just so happens to be the right height uh, for the um, for the cogs. So with a, a layer of uh, polystyrene uh, in between the the uh, chain, uh, then I can lay a piece of thin card on top. So I'll do that, and I'll be back in a moment. So we've put the polystyrene between the uh, chain itself which will support the wheels of the car as it goes around um, I'll put one magnet if I can get one 
on the track like so although you have to remember you have to remember where you put it so we've got a magnet there and then if I can... put a thin sheet of uh, card over the top like so then with uh, in this case just a simple drawing pin to hold hold the card in place like that and then another magnet uh, I'll keep losing another magnet there where the uh, other one is and we can put the car on and with any luck we have a moving car system of course, of course the only problem is <laughs> with this having to turn it manually we need uh, an, a slow electric motor obviously without this uh, whole um, for, for this cog so with a, a slow electric motor and a setup like this um, you can let me just raise that up a little you can have a very cheap moving car system on a on a rail uh, a train layout instead of having to buy all those expensive uh, systems that you can buy I could play with this all night <laughs> fantastic so you can see the uh, possibilities this is all I'm trying to show you the possibility of, uh, of a very very inexpensive uh, road network you can uh, in fact I have tried linking four um, bicycle chains together uh, going round a really big uh, um, road track but then your problems start um, as soon as you start joining two pieces of car together uh, that's where it, the problems start where, uh, in fact that would be the problem even if you had one of those expensive uh, 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 car systems anyway those uh, plastic systems um, you still have to join cards together and you have to get the magnet and the car over those joins um, but you know that, that's a, a problem uh, that can be solved or you could just have a very small uh, system within your uh, train setup uh, about as big as this maybe just a small village with a car going round um, it would be very inexpensive to buy a slow slow electric motor uh, to put underneath your, your uh, unit um, to make that work but all it is is a bicycle chain and uh, half a dozen of these cogs that's all it is so um, just a thought <laughs> um, I, I'll show you I, I've got some buildings I'll, I'll set up a, a small town and uh, and show you uh, show you in situ so i'll be back in a moment okay we've got a few buildings around the place now just to make it look um, a bit better so that's what it could look like if you <laughs> if you did it properly again i'm going to have to take it off and I'll just go around once more just to show you. So that's my very inexpensive uh, road system. Um, please, by all means, if you're interested, give it a go. But please let me know how you get on. Uh, send me any videos that you have uh, constructing and uh, uh, using the, uh, the the system 
if, if you did go ahead. Um, if you went ahead and, and uh, made a big thing of it, a big company, multi-million multi -million pound uh, road system, uh, please send me 50% of the profits. <laughs> but um, it's just something that you might want to toy about, toy around with uh, to, um, to include on your uh, train set out. Uh, anyway, thank you very much for watching, if you have watched the whole video. Um, it may be interesting to some. Um, please subscribe to the channel. Uh, it's uh, doing very well at the moment, For considering it's only three months old. Uh, we're doing okay. Uh, but please subscribe anyway, and you'll be uh, notified of any new videos that I make. Uh, not necessarily road systems, but uh, other things. Uh, so, uh, good luck if you do try to uh, to do something like this. I'll just go around once more. Oh, I'm changing. There we go. It's coming around there. And stop. And go. Uh, so you have full, full control over the, uh, over the vehicles. So thank you for watching and uh, hope to see you again in the next video and uh, happy modelling.